Hello subscribers, today is Thursday, June 22nd and a second day of boring markets. It was for me anyways. But before I let you watch the trading session because it is a little bit longer today, a little bit better uh, commentary. I wanna let you know that I'm gonna start something new. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna call it, but I'm gonna start giving you a tip or two every Thursday that will help you at home uh, trade a little bit better. And the very first tip that I want to talk to you about is do not trade the first five minutes of market open for one main reason of too much volatility. You don't know where the markets are gonna go, whether up or down. And also the options market, spreads in the options market are, are very wide. In most instances, there's five to 10 cent spreads right as the market opens. So you wanna wait till the market settle down and, and then you can choose uh, where to get in because if you get in and the spreads are so wide, you're at an immediate loss. And you don't want that. Before I let you go, hit that subscribe button, like and share my videos, please comment below what you think. And if you have any questions in general about trading, um, I'll be more than happy to answer them. Thank you so much for watching. Good morning, guys. We are about a minute and a half away from the opening bell and already the markets seem to be um, rallying. It's uh, looking like it's going to be an easy call day today. And uh, obviously, as always, let's uh, see about uh, finding a good setup for us to profit on. We're just going to be patient here uh, right off the bat. Uh, we're going to let everything settle down at least for uh, maybe the next five minutes or so, maybe 10. Just trying to see where the markets wants to uh, settle down and, uh, and go from here. There you are. Yo. Yo. What's up, man? Nothing, man. I had to make little man breakfast and had me running a couple minutes late. Nice, nice. I was watching it on my phone down in the kitchen, though. <laughs> <laughs> Off of the uh, Thinkorswim uh, app? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> it's so wonderful. It was looking like an easy call day today, but yeah. not so much now. No, not so much. Well, there's consumer confidence that comes out in at 9. Or at 10, rather. Yeah. Consumer confidence. FOMC member Powell speaks. That shouldn't be anything to worry about. Waiting and waiting. I got the finger on the uh, trigger here, and there's no uh, momentum. We're not getting it. Nope. Didn't get it. What? <laughs> My phone's making noises I've, I've never heard before. I don't... <laughs> I don't know what happened to it. <laughs> it's starting to look really good here, man. Volatility is uh, good all across the board. We just need the markets to decide. All right, looks like puts are in play. I'm not in yet, but oh, yeah. 43s. I'm still looking at the 243 puts for tomorrow. Gosh, look at that. As soon as I said that. <laughs> well, I was going to say I was about to jump in on the 243 call. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five times it has switched direction. It definitely feels like the markets are waiting for something. Yeah, it's like they're in limbo. I'm looking for a setup here. 243 puts. Looking like they might be in play. I'm being hesitant to get in on this setup here. Just no momentum anywhere in the markets right now. I decided not to trade it. I just I hesitated. I didn't like how there's uh, how the markets are super flat right here. And we'll see if there's another setup down below. We're about to hit the low of the day, 242.64. So uh, just be patient here. When, oh, sorry about that. Just be patient here, um, and uh, we'll see for we'll wait for another setup to to happen. Well, I guess in a way I was uh, I was correct in that there's just no true momentum here. Um, although uh, everything is red, um, just the markets, the markets aren't cooperating with us today. Um, it's only down 18 cents on the day so far, and we're uh, an hour in. Um, so again, just be patient. Um, I got to learn to be more patient. I feel like I'm a really, uh, really uh, disciplined trader, but uh, sometimes I get ants in my pants and, and I want to, you know, trade. You know, that's, that's the addiction, right? But uh, just with a little bit of patience and discipline and the right strategy, uh, you'll probably. 
And there she goes back up. Sitting and waiting, nothing is setting up, nothing is moving. Uh, that's the uh, best part about this. That's the best part about the uh, strategy is the, uh, the strategy itself, uh, the way we trade it, um, tells you, um, hey, there's, there's strength, um, there's weakness, it's flat. Um, it, it, it's that good, uh, the way we trade it. And um, that's fine. That's fine that uh, I wasn't able to get an entry here and uh, continue to be patient. There's a big uh, quick jump here in the uh, markets. <laughs> There's a big uh, move here uh, to the upside. Uh, maybe the, uh, the calls are back in play. Let's see here. Let's see what happens here very very tight range that we're in today let's take a look at the daily look at that wow what a big move what a big move it uh, punched right through the high of the day and now i'm going to be looking for an entry might not get the uh entry that i'm hoping for but uh yeah it's just uh, a lot of momentum here a lot of momentum looks like here is where we're going to consolidate um which is good it's great for me <laughs> so i can uh get in on this uh on this move here all right just waiting for for another pop up here i really believe here um that it'll continue going up um just by looking how everything is set up the uh, 15 minute uh, looks like it has all the room to to grow uh the five minute looks um kind of uh, a little bit topped off that's because of that huge uh, move so quickly watching it really closely here. I went ahead and bought in at 67 cents it's at 66 by 67 looking really good here. I'm still in it um, The one minute looks like it might consolidate here I'm back down to even I'm really confident in this trade um, It's looking uh, really good here uh, for another leg up and it looks like we're gonna move higher here there we go let's go ahead and sell um, I didn't get what I wanted to I sold that at 70 I didn't make hardly anything uh, oh I sold that at 71 okay we're good we're okay we're okay thinking here um, I'm glad I got out um, I made exactly six percent again that's the lower um, end of my target of uh, five to ten percent uh, yesterday I made 10%. Today I made 6%. We're we're good. We're all good. There's no no harm, no foul. I made money, uh, and it, it just took so long. Two hours into the opening bell, that's whenever I, I was able to place my trade. And 6%. Um, that might not sound a lot uh, to a, a whole lot of people, but um, the people that are playing the penny stocks, you know, they they sure you can make hundreds and hundreds of percentages at at a time, but most people don't. Most people don't make, um, you know, five um, percent. There are people that make, you know, fifty percent, hundred percent, a thousand percent. But here we make five to ten percent consistently every day. Uh, that's five to ten percent of your money. Compound that each and every day, and uh, then you're making some really, really good money. Um, thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry this took uh, so long. Uh, but I'm hoping that uh, you can at least see the value in the strategy that I use. Uh, again, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. It would help me out tremendously. I'm trying to get to 100 subscribers. Like and share. Comment below what you think. Um, if you have any questions, concerns, any any uh, any general question about the stock market, I'll be willing to. Uh, I'll be more than happy to uh, try to answer that for you. If I can't, I don't know. Um, I don't know, nor do I claim to know, nor do I have all the answers. I will try my best to answer them as best as I can. Thank you so much. We'll see you tomorrow.